Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Karen Hernandez. Today we're going to do something a little bit different and what I'm going to be showing you my favorites for the month of January. Uh, it's a mix of different products, uh, beauty products, household products, and just different things that I've really been enjoying or that I really enjoyed for the month of January. The first thing I'm going to show you is this candle. It is from the company Bloom and Prosper. This is what it looks like. And the scent that I have is Cactus Blossom. And it smells so good. And I'm very picky with my scents. And I will probably be repeating that throughout the video because I'm very picky. I do not like sweet, sweet scents. And I don't like flowery scents. And I also don't like it to be too woody. I don't know. But this is right up my alley. So I've used almost a whole half of this big old candle. And the, the company is Bloom and Prosper Candle Company. And again, I have the, the scent Cactus Blossom. And it smells so good. If you're a candle fanatic like me, I love candles. Um, but I have to hand pick them because it's just, I'm very picky. And yeah, this one, I actually got it at Ross and it was $7.99. It still has a little tag on here. $7.99. The next thing I'm going to be showing you is my perfume. I've actually been using this one for more than just January. But my husband for Christmas got me a new one. And, again, I just love it. It's such a unique scent. And it's very similar to my candles and everything else I'm going to show you. It's just my scent. And this is the Versace Arrows uh, perfume. And this is the, it's a yellow one. And it just smells so good. But you can get it online. You can also find it at Sephora. I've seen them there as well. Or at like a Dillard's, a Macy's, Nordstrom, places like that. It just smells so good. So if you're looking for a perfume, I definitely recommend this one. The next thing I'm going to show you is... The Beauty Creations Flawless Day, Found Flawless Day Foundation. I dedicated an entire video to this foundation. And ever since I got it, I have used it nonstop. I've tried using it in different ways. With a sponge, with a brush, and different forms like that. I've tried using it with different powders. And my favorite way to use it is with a brush. And yeah, I really like this foundation. This is also very inexpensive. And I definitely recommend it. The next thing I'm going to show you are these black kids. I am not a big, um, like a sneaker person. And my husband got me these for Christmas as well. And they're so comfortable. And they're black because I just, I wear a lot of black. So, yeah, they're kind of dirty. So it's kind of embarrassing. But they, they're the Dream Foam... Memory is what it says, and it just says Keds. I'm not a big, uh, like, uh, brands, and I don't keep up with that kind of stuff, but these shoes are so, so good. And they match with everything, and they're so comfortable. I've worn them for hours and hours, and they are my favorite shoes. Every time I go, I'm going somewhere where I know I'm going to be on my feet a lot, I wear these shoes. Uh, the next thing I'm going to show you are these three brushes. These are from the brand Luxie, and... I have four of them, but these are the three that have stood out the most to me. It's a flat brush, a blending brush, and a large blending brush. I've used, I think I've used all three in my previous videos. The big uh, blending brush, this is a Luxie 250. This one is a Luxie 243. I love this one. I think of all three, this one is my favorite. And this is a Luxie 246. This is a little flat brush. And this one, this little one, is perfect to use for your, uh, to set down foundation before a color. This one is perfect. It's the perfect size, and it's strong enough for that, but it's not too rough. These are such good brushes. So, yeah, these are three brushes that I've really enjoyed this past month. The next thing is... This Violet Voss Essentials Palette. I actually also use this one. 
in a recent video and this palette is so good it has the basic nudes like the basic uh, warm tone shades it has four shimmer shades and it has a gold which is very what most of us use it has a cream and it has a just a lot of very very good colors oh it also has a matte black these are just the essentials for a good eye look this is to me this is a good traveling palette if you're someone who travels a lot you're gonna really enjoy this palette this is a violet boss essentials pro series eyeshadow palette the next thing i'm going to show you is this this is my favorite 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 body wash um like i said before i'm very picky with my scents uh when i buy anything that has a scent to it i have to smell and smell and smell until i find like that exact one and that was the case for this this is the uh bath and body works shower gel in cactus blossom i also have the body cream i use both and it's so good and i actually have a whole brand new set because we went to uh the mall not too long ago and this body wash, you will not regret buying this. It, the scent is, is fresh, but it's also, um, I don't know, toned down. I can't explain it, but if you like uh, Bath and Body Works, and the next time you go, you need to look for this. You are not going to want to go back to whatever you were using before. Because that's what happened to me. Um, I had like, because I'm so picky, when I find something, I stick to that. And that's what, ha and now this has replaced my old body wash. And yeah, this is so good. This bottle is empty, as you can tell. And this lotion has, it's about halfway. And they always have the best um, deals. The last time I went in, it was three for three. So my husband also has a body wash that he likes from there. So every time we go, I'll get like two things and he'll get his body wash. And then we get three items free, so we'll just mix and match. And sometimes I bring some to my mom, and she loves that scent as well. And she's older, so it just works all around. It's so good. The next thing I'm going to show you is this little container. I got this little container at Dollar Tree, and it's so cute. And it's the perfect size for sugar. We use it for our sugar, and then I got this other one. This is like a little mason jar. And we use this one for salt because it has a little holes like a salt shaker. And these are so cute. They were $1 each at Dollar Tree. They have so many cute little containers. If you're ever looking for something like to put in like a small gift or like a housewarming gift, these are perfect for that. And I love these. And they're just so, so cute. So yeah, those I've been loving. And I believe that is it. So yeah, the other thing that I was going to mention is my ring light that I purchased in January. Um, I got it on Amazon and it was like $23 or something like that. It was not expensive and it works really good. It has three settings and you can dim the light, you can make it uh, brighter. It has, um, it connects to a USB so usually when we film we connect it to my laptop. And it has the adjustment for the camera, which is what is on it right now. And I also use it for my live videos because it has the adjustment for my phone as well. So yeah, those are the products that I have been loving this month. And I will try to link everything uh, that I mentioned in the description box below. I hope that if you're like me, I love watching these videos. Especially like the Amazon ones. Or I'm going to try to do that one next. But for this past month, January, these are the things that I've been loving. And that was it for this video. Um, comment down below if there's a product that you've been loving and that you think I should try. Or if you're a very picky uh, with your scents and with your fragrances. And comment down below anything that is similar to what I showed you that you've been liking. I would really appreciate that because I'm always looking for something new. And thank you so much for watching. That was it for this video. And I'm Karen Hernandez. And thank you.